Today on the van, the plan of action is to paint all of the door jams and the inside of the back doors and the sliding door. The plan for these is to paint them black rather than body color. This is mainly because you can see a little bit of the metal from the inside and the green of the outside doesn't really match fully with the color of the inside. So I'm gonna do it black but the little strips that you can see from the inside, they join up to like the carpet and the bit of trim that I've put in the carpet. So that's obviously black. So it'll be all black rather than having like a small strip of green. There's a few bits that will be done uh, green just because they need to be and they can be seen from like the outside through. So they're not going to be black. And I also need to just paint there's, there's a slight gap between each of the trims that I've refitted. I didn't realize there would be a gap. So there's a little bit of silver and green visible. So that's just gonna, I'm just gonna mask that up and paint that in with a brush. All of the door jams, I'm just gonna roll it and brush paint. The military paint is quite self-leveling, unlike a normal sort of two-pack paint that you'd spray. So that'll not be an issue, you shouldn't really get any brush marks or anything. So hopefully that'll be done by the end of the day. And then there's just the roof left to do. So I'll move the van around the corner because there's telephone wires on the drive, which means the birds land on there. And I've already had to respray the bonnet because bird pooed on it. And I don't really fancy doing that with the roof. So what I'll do is I'll move it around the corner, just take the ladders around, park it so there's no trees or anything above, and then I'm just going to roll that rather than spraying it. So yeah, in this one I'll do the door jams and stuff, and then hopefully the next video will be finishing off the roof, and then I can get the solar panel back on because the solar panel's just sat in the office at the minute. So that needs to go back on the roof. I've obviously uh, sealed up the holes um, and I'll just re-screw that on, re-bolt that on. Once the roof's painted, so yeah, we're nearly there.
As always, thank you for watching. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next one.